The HTF 5680A1 is a Chinese military heavy duty transporter erector launcher telephone vehicle developed by Tian Special Vehicle Company. It plays a key role in China's mobile missile force, specifically as the main launch platform for the DF 26 Intermediate Range Ballistic Missile IRBM. First revealed publicly during Chinese military parades in the mid 2010s, the HTF 5680A1 has since become a symbol of China's growing missile mobility and rapid response deterrent capabilities. Designed as a 12x12 wheeled heavy transporter, it allows the Chinese People's Liberation Army Rocket Force PLARF to launch missiles from various off road and concealed positions, increasing survivability and tactical flexibility. The HTF 5680A1 is powered by a Dutes turbocharged diesel engine delivering approximately 517 horsepower, giving it sufficient mobility to transport the massive DF-26 missile across complex terrain. Its operational range is around 800 km on a full load, and it can reach speeds up to 65 km per hour on roads. The vehicle is designed with off-road conditions in mind and features high ground clearance, central tire inflation system, and all-wheel drive capabilities. With a weight nearing 35 tons and the ability to carry a similarly weighted payload, the HTF 5680A1 enables quick deployment of long-range missiles without the need for fixed launch sites. This mobility significantly complicates any adversary's targeting process and enhances China's second strike capability. Visually, the telephone is notable for its bulky frame, large cabin that accommodates up to six crew members, and a distinctively raised roof to fit the DF-26 missile canister. Its dimensions and structure are specifically engineered to handle the weight and length of the missile, which has an estimated range of 3,000 to 5,000 kilometers, depending on the warhead. The DF-26 itself is dual-capable, meaning it can carry both nuclear and conventional payloads. It also includes an anti-ship variant that has earned it the nickname, Carrier Killer, targeting large naval vessels such as U.S. aircraft carriers. This strategic role places the HTF 5680A1 at the center of China's efforts to deny enemy forces access to critical maritime zones. As of mid-2025, there is no official confirmation of a newly developed 2026-specific variant of the HTF 5680A1. Most available data indicate continued use and possible incremental upgrades rather than a major redesign. While the Chinese military often operates with a high degree of secrecy, public sources and recent satellite imagery show continued deployment of HTF 5680A1 based TELs in various PLA rocket force brigades, particularly in inland areas that offer natural protection and concealment. Though it shares design elements with larger TELs like the HTF 5980, which is used for the DF-41 ICBM, the HTF 5680A1 remains optimized for the DF-26 class and its specific mission set. There is speculation that future variants might include improved electronics, hardened command systems, or automated deployment procedures, but no open source intelligence currently confirms these changes as part of a formal, 2026 upgrade still the htf 5680a1 is expected to remain in service for many years due to its proven reliability and strategic importance its continued use underscores china's focus on mobility deterrence and survivability in modern missile warfare